What's going on everybody? Welcome back. So today I'm going musky fishing with my good buddy Sam Scott from Blue Ridge Musky. If you guys have not checked out Sam's YouTube channel, make sure you click the link down in the description below because he's probably one of the fishiest musky fishermen that I've ever met. He's put me on so many different fish here and he puts so many first time musky anglers on their first musky. Like more people than I've, I've ever met. It's insane, but he just got this awesome new stealth craft boat. I'll give you guys a rundown of this, or better yet, I'll let Sam give you the full rundown on this new rig. It's been quite a while since I've done any musky fishing, so I'm super excited to be out here. The river's looking great, hoping that we'll be able to stick a couple fish today. But if you open up that cover under your feet there, yep. that's where all the, bait, all the baits are. Nice. Help yourself. What are you throwing? Um, I'm probably gonna have to start with uh, there's a glider in here that Gaston made me. It would be a good bait to start with right there. Okay. Or any of these slow flows would be good. Oh, I saw that. Uh, you posted that yeah. the other day. Yeah, so this thing got a sick. lot of attention yesterday. Yeah, that thing is awesome. Yeah. It's, uh, I feel like it's rare to see a jointed musky glide. Yeah, yeah, it is rare, but man, the fish were loving it yesterday. I believe it. Really well made, and it swims so good. Uh, of course, the whale tails and OLTs are a good, good bet, no matter what. Uh, just a pull bait. This guy needs to be glued. There's uh, swim baits in here. Top water. Uh, fish have been hitting top water first thing in the morning. If you want to try that. Send it off. <laughs> I like it a lot, though. This thing's awesome. Sam's been building custom rods for what the last year? Yeah, a year, year and a half. They're sweet. I've seen quite a few of them. Very well done. This is my first time fishing one. I think it's sick. I once had like a white one out last time you came. Uh, I think you did too. When we were moving that real big fish. Yep. I can back this off in here. Ah, oh, you're good. Yeah. Awesome. Big fish, big fish, big fish. I'm good. He's on the good. Still on you? Yep. Oh, he was snapping at it. Oh, dang. Yeah, he was aggressive at first, but this is kind of cooling off now. Still there? Uh, I don't see him right now, but he was sitting right under it. Damn. You were snaking back and forth on it for a minute there. It looked like you were about to eat it. <laughs> Mid 40s. Solid. Oh, that was on the jointed glide. What is that called? What, what's it called? Oh, well, that's perfect then. That was a nice no fish, wonder. Though. Let's see if we can fire him up. Back. Oh, there he is. Back. back on it again. Yeah, look, look. Big fish, man. Oh, I saw it. Yeah. <laughs> you see that? You see that? Right, right underneath it. It's like right in the glare for me. I saw him when he came up, like right when you're like, oh, he's back on it. Turned around and I saw him snake left, it looked like. It was just sitting behind the boat. As soon, you, as, I, as, soon as I got in front of her, it came back up. Yep. Just like what you said, you're like, if I could guess, she's probably sitting right here. Oh, I just, oh, right there, boom, on that cast. I just saw one porpoise right there. Yeah, 100%. That was sick. I like started the cast and as I was looking out, I was like, what the swoon right at the bank too. I mean, I nailed wow. right on him. I could have landed this thing in his mouth. All right, well, it's been a bit of a tough day. We've seen two fish so far, and we've probably been fishing for four and a half-ish hours. It's just the way musky fishing goes sometimes. It seems like they're not very active right now, but Sam said there's a window around 2 p.m., and that is what we we're hoping is gonna be our window to catch some fish. Figured this would be a good time for Sam to tell us about this awesome boat he's rocking now. New for the, the guide setup, dude, you wanna 
tell everybody about this thing? Yeah, so it's a stealth craft. Uh, my last boat was a stealth craft, and this is a stealth craft PD sled. So it's a drift boat style boat. I can sit down, row it, it drafts real skinny, I can row through shallow water, but it's also got an outboard jet on it. It's got the Minn Kota Terova with eye pilot. It's got a power anchor. It's got all the bells and whistles uh, that turned me into the lazy guide. <laughs> <laughs> but it's uh it's versatile it's uh it it does a whole lot so i'm happy with it it's been real good for me so far clients like it it's got a nice big casting deck up here normally their pd sleds are more drift boat style so they're down in the boat and you have chairs you know down the middle but this we did a custom front deck for uh obviously casting from musky gets you the elevated position and there's a nice rear casting deck as well uh, and it's a great boat we like it so far also you guys see Sam's shirt here, James River Outfitter. He is opening up shop. Yeah, we're here. opening the first musky store in the state of Virginia. It's gonna be right here in Eagle Rock, Virginia. Uh, and just a couple weeks from now, we'll be opening, so. Awesome, dude. I am definitely looking forward to that. I'm gonna leave a link for that down below. It should be open by, I'll post this video by then, yeah. probably. Yeah. But I'll make sure that you guys will be able to find that link somehow. But. You find yourself down this way i mean either you want to go fishing with sam or go to the musky shop definitely definitely check that out so as i was editing this video i realized that i made a really big mistake with this one it's never happened to me before when musky fishing but i knew that i always ran the risk of this happening i run this gopro on a five minute loop which overwrites the previous minute while you're recording as it records a sixth minute so i stopped this camera way after I got the fish in the bag and I only got a portion of the fight. This one's gonna start at about halfway in. Oh my god, it's got some power. <laughs> got <him. clears throat> nice. <laughs> that was sick, dude. Hell yeah. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, that was pretty awesome. Woo! There you go. Nice. Woo. Very nice. First fish of the day after a bit of a long morning, seen three or four fish. Uh, Sam hooked into one, and I believe it might have actually been this, and I got lucky right there. But we're going to get a quick bump on this fish, see how long it is. What? 37. Oh. Awesome. Not too big, but I'll take any musky. She's like already ready. She's Keep ready, on. man. <laughs> Just like you said, that cold water gets them crazy. Cool. Thanks, Sam. Yeah, man, that was yeah. awesome. So sick. All right. Since I luckily was able to get a fish in the boat, I'm just going to go big for a while. Look how freaking big this thing is, guys. It's huge. What is it? This has got to be a 13-inch, 14-inch boot tail i mean giant swim bait right just as many ounces too it's heavy it is i was about to ask before i put it on if this rod would be okay with it but well, he'll do it, yeah. yeah it's fine i don't know if i'll be able to do it that long though. oh it's not too bad no. it's kind of like the one i was throwing last time the uh the bigger damn why can't i remember the name of that thing oh the magnum shadzilla shadzilla yeah the magnum shadzilla oh that is so cool that is a big freaking bait, dude. The tail's got some kick for sure. That thing's gonna dominate this winter. I mean, this looks awesome. Got him. He's big. He's big. Sam's on. Sam's on. Oh, it's a big one. It's a big one. Uh, oh my god, dude. Which way? Oh shit. Stay down, baby. Got In him. there, baby. Yes! <laughs> Woo! Yeah, buddy. That's a good one. Yes. Hell yeah. That was awesome. Glad we came back down here. Yes, sir. I like the move. I like the, uh, the thought process on that i was all yeah, for it when you're I mean, like man see, we should go back where we wanted to be today we just weren't seeing a lot of fish yeah but we, we moved two miles back up the river and started seeing fish because we hit that window so i was like might as well come down where we know there's a lot of fish yep <laughs> e688 
D E D. Oh, hold on. Oh, you got it. Cool. Woo! Here we go. That's a nice fish. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, 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 and I've caught a couple of fish on this already, but that fish, when it hit, just completely swallowed this bait. There was nothing left of it. And uh, I thought it was much bigger than what it was, but it was a healthy fish. 43 and a half inches, but just healthy, really heavy. And we could feel something in her belly. She had just eaten something else. I could feel around in her belly. But cool, man. That's, uh, that's two fish in an hour here. We might have a little window. Let's get back to it. Something big was right there. Huh? Something big was right here. You I just saw something push. I I mean, there's a big wake. It's a nice hole. Yeah. Whoa, what was that? Giant turtle. Oh my god. Oh, see how see big that, that dude is? Oh. Oh, little tiny one. <laughs> you followed that big thing in? Yeah. Wow. Do you see it? No. I mean, it was probably 30. Yeah? Yeah. I can't tell if he's still... No, I don't see him. But something followed it. It was on Heck it. yeah. First cast, new spot. Where'd you go, boo-boo? What do you think, bud? I'm ready when you are. Ready to roll? Yep. Let's do it. Solid day. Yeah, it was fun, man. Hell yeah. All right, everybody, we are finished up here. My good buddy, Sam. Uh, awesome day. Bagged two fish. We probably saw, what did we get? Six? We saw six fish. You hooked one I think more. we saw more than six. We lost the one. Yeah. On the shallow invader. Yep. Lost the one. And I mean, we had, yeah, we probably had six more follows or so. Something like that. And that was like a slow day out yeah, here with Sam, slow day. which is funny because that's, I mean, that's still a pretty darn good, a good day. day. You know, yeah. we caught two, hooked one, hooked another one and saw whatever, three or four more. Yeah, but like the morning, what well, we moved one fish first thing in the morning, so mm -hmm. that kind of got things going, but then we didn't see anything for like four hours. It was, like, it was a slow. very, <laughs> very long lull, but that's, I mean, what I always think about when I'm musky fishing is like, it can just turn on. Yeah, and you even and said it. You even said it. You were like, I know how it goes, man. You know, yeah. I, I don't care if we see fish for the next four hours, but we'll get into a bite winter this evening. That's exactly what yep. happened. It was like as soon as you called it too, you yep. said like right between major. two and four, two and five, yep. something like that. And right at like two, two thirty is when they started showing up. And yeah, it was, left and right. I mean, we got those two hot follows and then I lost the one on the shallow invader and then you caught one all within like 30 minutes. Yep. It was awesome. Awesome bite window. Awesome day, dude. Yeah, Thank man. you so much as always. I had a blast, dude. Always a great time. If you guys want to come out and fish with Sam, make sure you click the link down in the description below. Come out with Mr. Blue Ridge Muskie himself. Go catch some big muskie. Enjoy this awesome stealth craft. Thing is sweet. He'll get you up and down the river like with ease. And he's awesome to fish with. So make sure you click the link, give Sam a call, go book a trip. Also, don't forget about the uh, James River Outfitters, too, yeah. coming out soon. But yeah, we'll, we'll be opening that in a couple weeks here, and we'll announce on all the social media. I'm sure I'll have you by when, when we get open. For sure. Yeah. I'm absolutely going to come by and check That'd it out. cool. First musky shop in the state of Virginia. We've been needing something like this for a while. That's huge. Very cool. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button for me. See you on the next one.